Hello again guys, Gazu back again here and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Ganyu banner and we're going to be figuring out are the 4 star characters worth it. Before we get into it, don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button. Hit the little eye on the top right, let me know what video you want to see next. Without further ado, let's just jump straight into it. Now firstly, Jingxu and Zhengling are good synergies with Ganyu. So if you do summon Ganyu, having a high constellation Jingxu or Zhengling might not be a bad idea. If you want to have a freeze comp or a melt comp, either one works. As for Noelle, Noelle's kind of just, you know, there. She's a really good C6 character. I don't think it's going to be good with Ganyu. There's nothing really specific that synergizes with Ganyu, except for like maybe a shield, but other than that, you can get that from other people. But for characters that synergize with Ganyu, yes, Xingqiu and Zhengling would be a good idea. With Xingqiu, his elemental skill will help you take less damage, because Ganyu is a little bit squishy, so this might not be a bad idea. As for his ultimate, we'll have the Rain Cutter Swords, so every time you hit, the swords will apply wet. So this would be really good on a freeze comp. Jumping straight into the C6, activating two Guya Swords, Rain Cutter Swords, Rain Attacks greatly increase the damage of the third. Jingchu regenerates three energy when the Sword Rain attack hits opponents. So this would be good for spamming his ult, just straight up extra damage, as well as the rest of those constellations really help out in terms of making that support sub DPS damage a lot higher. Increase the maximum number of Rain Swords, extend the duration, increase the damage. It's a good option if you get a Jingchu to C6. On top of that, if you don't want to use him with Ganyu, there's characters like Hu Tao, D Luke, Klee, just pyro characters, or just any character. Uh, Xingqiu makes a great sub DPS just for that applying hydro. You can even run it on child if you want to have a double water team. But yes, Xingqiu, a very, very good pick. Next up we have Zhangling. Now Zhangling is also really good with Ganyu. Beside that, she is pretty much a good fire sub DPS. Both Goba and the Pyronado is really good for trying to get that melt reaction team. So with Ganyu, you could just drop down Goba and then start spraying and then easy easy melt. Uh, as for her C6, you get 15% increased pyro damage for the duration of Pyronado, so just a flat increase for herself if you don't have any pyro on your team. C4 pyro duration is increased by 40%, which is pretty fat. Overall, just good fire sub DPS. Remember, think about if this character is going to work on your team, if you're going to get the desired elemental reactions or damage output that you want with this character. For example, if you had a Diluc on your team, you might reconsider if you want Zhengling. Yeah, you get the elemental resonance, but you will get a lot more damage if you use the Xingqiu. Vice versa, if you're running like a child, Xingqiu is still a good pick, but having that melt damage might be a little better. Again, just make sure it implements well on your team. Now as for Noel, this is where it's a little different. We know Noel can be played as a support because of the shield and the heal and, and her ultimate is DPS. The thing with C6 Noel is that sweeping time increases Noel's attack by an additional 50% of her defense. Additionally, every opponent defeated during this duration adds 1 second to the duration, up to 10 seconds. C6 Noel can pretty much make her some fat DPS, like even the C4. When breastplate duration expires or is destroyed, it will deal 400% attack of geo damage to surrounding opponents, 400% fat damage. C2 and C1, pretty much the same thing. They're just really, really good options that make Noel a pretty good DPS and support at the same time. Yeah, Noel's not a bad pick. Everyone should have Noel from the starter summon, so getting a C6 might not be too hard to get. Even if you don't get to C6, you can still get some pretty good buffs from the previous constellations. Noel as a character individually, yes, she is a pretty good option to pick. All in all, yeah, this banner is actually pretty good to summon on. Unlike Albedo's banner, where Sucrose, Bennett, and Fischl, they're all really, really good. Could be played on any team, really, except for a few exceptions, but besides that, they can really be put on any team. With Jingchu and Jangling, I guess you can say they could be put on every team, but again, to maximize them, you'd have to have specific characters that allow elemental reactions. Like Bennett and Sucrose, they don't have to worry about elemental reactions because they are supports. With Albedo's banner, I would say that's a must summon, because supports could be played anywhere. Unlike Ganyu's banner, these are sub DPS's, and just make sure you would be able to use them. The best C6 out of the three would probably be either Noel or Jingchu, because Jingchu, you get the increased damage on the third hit and the energy recharge when a sword hits, and Noel, she just gets the additional 50% of her defense to attack. This pretty much makes her able to, I want to say main DPS, as well as support, kind of fit all the roles into one character, in a way. Depends on how you build her in the end. Yeah, Ganyu's banner, I'd say it's pretty good. I wouldn't say it's the best banner, but the characters on there are not bad options. Jingxu and Zhengling work really well with Ganyu if you do want to summon her. You could either go with a freeze or a melt comp or maybe a little bit of both. 
So what does your team need? Do you need Vaporize, Freeze, or Electro Charge? You have Jing Chu? Or do you just want a general overall good support that can also maybe DPS? At High Constellation, you got Noel. And of course, if you want to summon for the Coco Goat herself, there should be no question as to summoning. If you want to know more information about Ganyu, or maybe team building, hit the little I in the top right. It should take you to the video. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. I wish you the best of luck for summoning. Let me know who you want down below. Till then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.